the youth room flooded. Hey guys, we're gonna do the study in my home office this week as the youth room has had a, a flooding issue because of the fridge. And uh, I'll show you a picture in a little bit. But we're gonna dive into Exodus chapter 12 where we've been talking about the idea that God is, is starting the Passover. Now what he's doing is he's describing what he's about to do in Egypt, but as he describes it, he starts to point ahead to what their life is going to look like when they've been released and, and rescued out of Egypt and gone and started the kingdom of Israel uh, in this new land, the promised land that God is taking them to. And what we learn in this section is that God is starting to form a new pattern of life. See, what God is doing is he's setting up holidays. And in this section, in chapter 12, he's starting to describe how they're going to remember that God did this. And they're going to remember who he is and who they are as God's people because of it. And what we learn from that is it's good for us to have a pattern of life that reminds us of the lessons that we learn that God has shown who he is and who we are because we are his people. See, for us as Christians, it's a, it's a good thing in our lives to regularly remember and even celebrate together what God has done. And so we have Christmas and Easter and we get to celebrate the birth of Christ, the miracle that is, and then his death and resurrection and, and the mercy and the grace that God shows through that. Uh, and then even in other times in, in, in throughout our lives and throughout, throughout the year, we should be reminded of, of what God is doing. We should take time together to celebrate how God has, has provided something for us, how God has helped us get through a difficult situation, how God has, has changed and a, a, transformed a life, right? a heart and, and lives being changed by God is something that we want to celebrate. And so it's good for us to learn, even from this passage where God is describing the Hebrew calendar 2,000 years ago, how they should live, what they should look like before the nation is even formed, just this people group remembering what God did to rescue them out of Egypt. That's a pattern, an example that we want to follow in the same way that we want to know who God is and who we are as God's people and that we want to be reminded of the lessons that we learned, particularly in this instance, that God is powerful, that God is merciful, and that through that God makes a way for our rescue.